In the previous tutorial, we talked about 3D sketching. We created this table by 3D sketching, as you see the 3D sketch here. And exactly like the previous sketching, you are able to rename it and add a name for it, for example. And to edit it also, you can click on there. Here you can change the name if you want. 3D table and if you click on that you have edit sketch exactly the same like the 2d sketching you are able to edit again your sketch let's add some dimension here so let's make a table with one meter wide and Give it 600 leg size. And when you are done, you can click exit sketch we have this sketch now let's start working with members so weldments is actually members structural members which are going to be welded together so the section member they having different types let's start the first uh, icon so when you are adding this icon here that means you are able to start working with the weldments. So it is an important icon to show you that you are in the weldments tool. So now our 3D sketch is ready. Our weldment environment is activated. So we are ready to work with weldments. In the next tutorial, we're going to show you the different types of members or structural members that SOLIDWORKS offers you to work with. So see you in the next tutorial.